What's going on, everyone? We are back for some more Darkest Dungeon 2. And we are heading to the lair boss. And, um, not the lair boss, the uh, mountain boss on our second confession. Uh, we're going to go ahead and eat some flapjacks, get some HP and resistance buff. And, um, yeah, so Plague Doctor and you. I did not mean to, I meant this one is actually what I meant. There we go. Alright, boost their relationship a little bit. Um, had a little bit of a look around here. I don't, there's not really any trinkets or anything that I see. However, we have some medicinal herbs here. Now, medicinal herbs pair with this trinket here. So we're gonna get 10% crit on our melee skill and 50% healing given, which sounds good. Uh, turn start if first in turn order, get vulnerable. We are not gonna be first in turn order. So if we do this and we buy the medicinal herb, buy two, just in case I need to use one. Pop that in there. That's going to be 50% um, healing given and more crit. And then the other thing is, if you look at the struggle bus here, this is going to add 100% bleed damage dealt. Uh, where are we? So let's go back here. So, I was thinking maybe we should add this um, trinket here will gives us bleed piercing and if they're marked that's even more bleed piercing so hopefully we can get some bleed damage going uh, which should be eight damage if I look at that right uh, which would be insane if we can get that stacking really high it does drop our bleed resist uh, I don't know if this boss is gonna be doing bleed resist but we can buy some of this and boost our bleed resist. We'll throw some burn resist on there. Just just all the resist. Look at that. 110 bleed resist. 60. 180 move resist. Like, I don't know what this boss is going to throw at us. Um, I really don't know. So Plague resist, heal, some stun resist. Maybe maybe we'll grab some stun resist. Why not? Let's let's get some stun resist going. Uh oh, what do we do? Okay. Um, I mean I'm disgusted by them as well. I'm not really sure what that does. Uh, combat item wise, we got some laudanum is fine. Stimulants, medicinal herbs. I feel like we can get rid of this. And maybe throw some more stimulants. Do we have any other? Um, ooh. So that'll be six bleed. Do we take the bear traps? Yeah, let's take the bear traps. And let's take the glimmer hopes too. Why not? All right, so. First we'll throw the glimmer hopes on there to keep our flame high. And then we'll, I hope, I don't have freaking squirrel brain, and we'll try to remember to switch that out for the bear trap. And yeah, as far as mastery goes, I'm thinking for the last fight, we'll switch out blinding gas for plague grenades. I really don't think the blinding and the daze will be hit. The mark is is definitely useful, um, but this does. Yeah, minus 33 piercing. Hmm. Alright, we'll see, we'll see. I, I, I'm debating if I should put this in, in place of the blinding gas, because I don't know how effective that's going to be on the last boss. We could also do, also do Nauseous Blast, uh, which does have... So this hits two, and it'll blight both. This is only one, but it has higher blight. Okay, we'll see, we'll see. I'm, I'm thinking about it. Um, as far as our grave robber goes, maybe I'll get rid of Dead of Night and we'll throw on flashing daggers. Uh, 
Oh, you know what? With the bleed... Should we get rid of... Hmm, what can we get rid of? Should I get rid of Wicked Slice and take Open Vein? Should we just, like... Start trying to stack, like, all the bleed? Uh, let's see. Man at Arms... Some super blocks, I guess. I really want to get more of his kit going. Like, I feel like him and the Grave Robber, they just have abilities that we're not really utilizing. And I really want to unlock some more stuff to get better, better synergy. Wow, words are hard. Um, hmm. I feel like our frontline damage is pretty stacked. Um... So maybe going for this for more backline damage. Mm, I'm kind of torn. Yeah, all right, let's just do it. Let's just do it. I know we have the um, piercing resist on it, but that is fine. So that's our mastery. We're all healed up here. Do we have anything to switch out? Chance to produce a this item? Nope, okay. Uh, we are heading to the Freaking mountain. Wails through desolate canyons. Do I the want to the sane world? I don't want to reduce speed. I, I think our relations are good. Let's just uh, let's go. We're heading into the mountain. We're heading to the boss. <sighs> I'm feeling pretty good about it, but you never friggin' know. Aspiration unites the so do we got? So de-stressor is it nauseous blast figures. Freaking figures, right? Okay, that's good. That's good. So whenever it's hopeful, is that just de-stress? Is that is that all it is? I mean uh, listen, I like it, I'll take it, not complaining. Uh de-stressing is de-stressing. Um, let me move some of our abilities. Hold on. Stop! I forgot to switch our abilities. At last, the great cigarette. All right, so we are gonna shut Emblem this off, of and we are gonna take regret. open vein. Hopefully, stack some of that bleed. Um, I'll leave dead of night on now for the first fight. And then switch to Flashing Dagger, possibly. You... I'll leave... Again, I'll... Sorry, I'll switch after the fight. Okay, so that was it. Let's go. Oh, I'm so nervous! I feel... Like we're pretty okay. Uh, the biggest thing that could probably screw us up would be repositioning attacks. We are going to have a fight before the mountain, right? Like, right? Okay, yeah, there it is. <laughs> I'm starting to get worried. I'm like, what? Do I need to switch stuff now? Alright. Oh, let's go. Fight, 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 fight. This fight should not be that big of a deal. We got a six blight right off the bat. Uh, yep. Twenty-one. Look at that. Just oh, so much damage. Oh, look, and then he's marked, right? So, yeah. Look at that. Most of these guys. Yeah. Okay. They don't even have like any bleed resist. So if I do this, let's test it out, right? Eight damage. Wow! An unavoidable end. So that's 14 damage, so he's dead. Big crit on the back there, that's not good. Um, go ahead and use the flame. And... Alright, let's start getting our defenses up. Is that the big old 10? Yes, it is. Yep, just 
just keep working that back. Oh my god, the one health. That's fine. That'll get rid of the dots on both. Savor it. Nice. Ah, oh, if only he had a way of hitting the back. I could get a little de-stress going. Yeah, let's get a little de-stressor going. All right, so he's dead next turn. A slow suffering begins. God. Look at that, and. Look at this. With the resists. 85 burn resists, and you still getting still getting the freaking uh the debuff. Sorry, right, you're dead. Let's start. Let's start getting up there. Alright, stressing out already. I really do not want to be entering in the final boss stressed out, so... Last. Don't think it matters. Super block, de-stress. Nice. Please die. Um... Not low enough. Nice. Oh, guys, I'm feeling so good about this. Come on. Yep, nothing. Let's go. All right, switch up abilities. So that's switched up. That's fine. We'll get rid of Dead of Night. We'll take Flashing Dagger. Get rid of Blinding Gas. And take... Wait, did I upgrade one of them? Upgrade the play grenade, yeah. Right? Two to three. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Uh, this we need to switch out for the bear trap. Laudanum, stimulant, medicinal. We swapped abilities. Alright, maybe we can get a tick of road healing on our way. And yep, there it was. Okay. That's it. I mean, not much else we can do. We're as prepared as we're going to be. Is revealed. The loathing Beyond abates. Only infernal nihility and non-existence. <sighs> the seething sigh. The seething the sigh. The ill-concealed rage. Okay, so analysis cannot move or be moved. Increase damage and stress dealt by sundering exhalation. Removed if sufficient damage is taken. Oh my god, he has massive bleed and blight resist. That is unfortunate. Our plan might be right out the friggin' Observe window. The carefully. And you will discover he does not, though, so we should be able to stack some damage up on him. All right, so we need to attack this front row, which we can't with this. So this is two to three. This is two to five. This does have... Oh, it's only the middle. Hmm. gonna buff him oh nice I didn't know it did that I thought it was just speed all right um oh well we have to attack the front row and the only one we can attack is with this so it's probably gonna resist yeah point blanket nice ah oh we're blind um all right, 50-50. <laughs> yes, is what it is. Wait. Why didn't the blind go away? Now we're weakened, too. God. Throw the bear trap on. That should be six. Nice. For three turns. Good. Um, 
bolster removes the weekend. Get the super blocks going. Alright, so this thing's inhaling again. Yeah, I mean, it's gonna resist the um, the debuffs. There's really nothing I can do about that. Open vein. Yeah, let's just... Aw oh, man, we just used bolster too. Okay. Yeah, so pretty much no... No bleed resist. What? What? Oh my god, the blind! Oh! confers advantage. <laughs> Oh, and he freaking resisted. Okay, all right, that's... We have some setbacks. Let's throw up a defender. So hopefully... Yep. Good. Throw them all on him. All right, so now it's the back one. Um, Which is unfortunate, because I can't pistol shot it from here. Do I point blank to get into the back and then hopefully be able to pistol shot it before he goes next turn? Oh, big crit. Four to seven. I don't know if that's going to be enough. We got the seven. God, he's stressing out. Cooperation Good. is the key. Okay. Um two to three damage. And it'll hit both. I mean, we're we're not gonna get the blight, right? We just need the damage basically to see if we can Okay, it deflated. Uh we are definitely gonna bolster. Super block, get rid of that. De stress. Good. That that is fine. We are not using him to attack. None of them. Okay, I was just gonna say none of them have inhaled, but there we go. Okay. So again, we're going down this rabbit hole of we're not doing we keep doing this, right? Okay, that's down. We're not really doing much damage to the boss itself, but slow and steady wins the race, I guess. Oh my god, the bleed resist! Some more blocks. Please don't stress me out. Nice dodge, nice repost. Shallow breath again in the back line, which is well, we can pistol shot now. So he's gonna go next. So if he is, what is this one buff? It buffs sundering exhalation, which we have not seen yet. He does have. A shuffle as well. That would not be good. Um, if we don't remove this before this turn, is he going to use it? I don't care. Oh, okay, I guess we'll find out. Nope, hysteria. Okay. So we have one more turn. Is that... You got look if you look at the health bar there's like a line through it. Um yeah, we need to de stress. Is that like the um uh 
like how much damage we need to do to it. Yeah, you see it went away. Alright, who's gonna inhale now? Front row. Front row's good. This does two to five, so I say we blight the boss. A slow dissection. And then we can wicked uh duelist advanced. Yeah, see that line there? That's got to be, like, the threshold of how much damage you need to do. Alright. Let's try to keep his stress under control. He's getting, what, two actions now? Nice resist. Nice resist. Wait, doesn't his thing... Hold up. Hold up. On move resist, gain a de-stress. That's actually really nice. He does not seem like he's debuffing us at all, which is... Oh, nice crit. Okay, that was actually... Very nice. Can we... Good, 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 good. God, the stress. Can we stack some bleed? Did you resist that? All right, blinding back there is not good. Um, can't use bolster. Now, if he does the breath on the back, that could be bad. No, of course he did. Um, so our highwayman's not in a position to attack the back. And we're blind here, so this is... Most likely gonna miss. Oh. Timed. We might find out what that big bad ability is pretty darn soon. Good. Yeah, that that um Does this remove blind? No. That um what you call it, trinket here? is going to really, really save us here. I need to de-stress. Doesn't really matter who I pick. All right, let's get him in position. Oh, so good. There it is. Oh my god, it hurts so bad. OK. So it's just a really big hit. And I'm almost thinking we should we should not move our highwaymen up, um, because that's it's just that's just not good. Get rid of the reposts. I mean, 19 heal. Look at that. All right, let's get rid of the burn. I think we're gonna leave. Oh my god, this is probably gonna miss. Uh, and carelessness. Of the a beautiful bear. crit pistol shot would be nice. No, we didn't get it. Oh, 11 was just enough. Oh. All right, this stress. He's. Oh my god, and we we can't. Um. Hmm. Let's see if we can slow him down. If we can go first, I might be able. God, the... Okay. Back row again. That's fine. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna use a laudanum there. From this carousel of oh, nice crit! Oh. So what happens if we kill these things? Do I just go ham? 
Why? Who needs a heal? Let's get that nice bleed damage on there. End. I, I might live to regret that, but we shall see. Dying Light. That one's new. Good. Thank you. Sweat-soaked brows. Unsteady stances. All right, now we're in the front. Exhaustion Dying Light. What was that? Just knock back stress. Everything stress. Stress, 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 stress. Okay. Uh, ooh. Do we heal? Could remove his blind. And de-stress a little bit, yeah. I have to remember that I can do that to... To remove, like, I could have removed Audrey's uh, blinds with that, potentially. Uh, four to six. Uh, this is four to eight, but I can't hit the front. Nine? Alright, good. In Woo! crisis, we can rely only upon each other. Alright, so minus. Let's see if we can keep him slowed down. No, I should get some super blocks going. That was, I think, that was a good call right there because that would have really freaking hurt. Alright, front line again. Nice resists. Oh, look at all that. It's so beautiful. I know it's going to resist the Blight, but that's her only front row attacking move. I am very curious to see... Like, what happens if we kill one of these things? Did you resist that? Alright, yeah, we definitely have to heal here. Uh, very possible... really need to de-stress. Alright. Possible she goes to death's door. Very possible. Oh my god, it's happening. Oh! That's fine. Give me all the negative trinkets. That's fine. Trinkets. Tokens. Whatever! So this is not going to do much damage. Do I take the heal? The dodges and the haste. I can always attack with our man at arms because he is in the front. Oh! That was a mistake. I was going to use this to remove the blind and the. Uh... Mm, that was a mistake. Now I'm wondering, do I attack here? Because our highwayman's only 4 to 6, and what's his? His is only 4 to 7, so that'd be... It's possible. Alright, now let's do this. Oh my god, no! Put the attack down! Alright, this is going to be dicey. So we got the six. Wrath and Rancor. Alright, we have to attack here. And we rolled low. Alright, we're going to take another big hit. Ow! Oh, the attack downs. Oh! Oh! Oh. Oh. <laughs> well. Well. I can 
try to get one down. Um, I could use a medicinal herb to get rid of his burn, and I need to heal. Oh no. Could use a medicinal herb, get rid of his burn. Heal myself. Forty-five. Why is it so low? Battle modifiers. Oh my god. Her death blow resist is seventy. So I'm thinking we heal our highwayman. She has a higher chance to resist the death blow. Yep. This is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt, like, really bad, probably. Oh my god, look at all those just... Mm. Can you please roll a 7? Or a 9. A 9 works too. Alright, one of them's down. This is still gonna hurt. Oh my god! Take aim will remove the blind and buff me and get dodge. Or I could pass to heal. I think I have to pass to heal because he's gonna do sundering exhalation, right? Yeah. So we're gonna go right back on death's door. Yep. Teetering on that Stress terrible. checks, here we go. Oh. Yep, here we go. This is where it all starts to fall apart. Okay. Well, at least it's only one this time. Oh, yeah, there's that. Um. <sighs> Do I have enough damage? Do I have enough damage between the man at arms and him? I'm gonna have to. There I'm gonna have to hope. Hope I do. Now climb. Um, let's do this. We still have one. Let's get rid of all this. Ah, oh, thank you for dodging. We got the five. It's not the best. Oh my god, I am at like. Oh! Six? Is that enough? Oh, it wasn't enough! Ow! And now, the greatest test. Oh my god. Please, something good. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. There we go again. In the back. Nice! Alright, we need that. We need that. We need that. We need that. That's good. That's good. Who's inhaling? Is it gonna be the front? Oh, it's gonna be both. Well. Two. Big two. Oh, she has the attack down. Everybody has the attack down. Collaboration. Alright, what's his death blow is this? Wow, look at it. So terrible. I don't I don't even know who to use it on to be honest. We're down to 33. I mean I feel like I have to use it here. The mind <sighs> grows tenuous. Ooh. These freaking attack downs are just 
all the debuff attack down lines. I could pass the heal. 39. Ugh. I could pass the heal. And then only dismiss 33. He's he's probably gonna die. Let's do it. Oh, this is, this, it's gonna hurt. Oh, he lived! He lived. Guys, just... <laughs> we were doing so good. Oh my god, both of them again? Like, all right, well, at this point, I don't know if I'm going to win. And I am kind of curious to see what happens if we kill one of these. All right, I was just checking the ounce of prevention skills, wondering if that had... Um debuff resist as well. Clearly we need debuff resist for this fight because this attack down, we were doing fine until all this blind and attack down crap. So... Do I heal or do I just like try to see what happens? I just want to, I'm going to see what happens. One, big one. Oh my god, someone's dead. Oh, there it is. She understood death. And there's another one. Oh. All right. I just, like I said, I just let's just see what happens at this point. Four to eight, but attack. Uh, yeah, let's just. We need a four. Can you get me a four? No, you can miss. We're all dead. This is no time to falter. <laughs> Let's just see what happens if we kill one. Oh, God, man. I was like... Mm. So, maybe... So, yeah, we could use Pick to the Face now. Maybe we should have switched our these two around. Really? I swear, if I don't... Oh, my God. We're not even going to see what happens. We're going to have two hit points left. Find it. And we're not even going to see what friggin' happens, are we? Oh, come on, I just... Let me just see what happens if I kill one. Please. Let me just see what happens if I kill one. Death blow. It's just gone. It's just gone, and you don't have to worry about it. Okay, well, there you go. Now we know Death what happens. Ah, uh, well... All right, so next time, what can we do? Probably better to move the Grave Robber into the third position so we could use a pick to the face. Didn't think about that. And then see if we could stack up on debuff resist items. Okay, I think that went pretty well. At least we know what to expect from the lair boss and the last boss here, so good learning experience. Um, I kind of like this, gives us more, or no, I'm sorry, where is it? Wasn't there this, so this gives us more to work with at the start. That's a lot, though. Hmm. Look to those who have known fear Stun resist. And in ample portion. Okay. Range skills, that would have been nice. And the stealth would have been nice. Still don't have Grape Shot Blast. Five percent damage for positive token. Highway robbery skill don't have if relics okay. Yellow hand path. Max HP. Range skills. Wow. Apply on hit melee skills. Um, I, yeah, I'm not, so that's just like his all melee build, I guess.
couple were Crush and Repost. So he gets Repost. That's good. That would have been handy there. Shield attack skills, 50. So is that like the shield slam? Shield attack skills, 10%. Okay, well... If rank 2, 25% max HP. Target command skill. Okay, if rank 1... Yeah. Well, we kind of have him in rank 1 a lot. Vanguard, Repost, Crush, and max HP at the cost of resists. Ah... <sighs> Plus two light damage dealt when stealth slow. Pick to the face, 50% damage. Turn start, convert stealth to crit, convert haste to dazed. We really didn't have a lot of haste with her except when we drank her potion, so I don't think that would be too bad. 50% more damage when stealth. Again, we don't have a lot of stealth options here uh, bah, 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 bah. we're not really using it for blight so that's like more of a blight roll target ounce prevention skill emboldening vapor skill also adds a heal but our battlefield medicine heals reduced huh so we could Actively buff our damage and heal at the same time, but it's a heal over time, not a direct heal. Could be good. Um, all right, let's. To recall a thing. Is where? To make it real yeah, we're more. gonna go here, and we're gonna go here. Might as well just start light, unlocking stuff. Strength. I don't know. I'm just clicking at this point. The true splendor of a world. Those who live within uh, it. Yeah, and then let's unlock... Where is it? Here it is. A welcome advance Candles of Hope, 4%. Okay. Uh, let's go with in item. See if we can get some debuff resist ones. Okay. Remove a plague. Or disease, or whatever that is. New Minus stress. I mean... Okay. Alright, well, guys. Overcome it. That was close. Uh, we were doing good for about the first half, and then once all those debuffs started stacking up, it just... The blinds, the damage reduction, and then we can't get the debuff gone. And then he's... Yeah. And then he's just wailing us with those sundering sighs. It just added up. But I think we were doing pretty good. Um, I really Your like... Sanctum. This initial setup, in I think, like, I kind of, I'm comfortable with it, right? I'm comfortable with it. They work well together. I'd say we just keep unlocking abilities, keep tweaking it, and try and try again. Thanks for tagging along, guys. We will set up another run and uh, maybe make some progress. Take care.